while we're on the topic of output, um, let's take a look at where we're going uh, as an example. And if you open the sheet set, um, we're in the project, and that's done by open a sheet set. And once again, in the jump, that will be in a discrete folder, right? All UDS compliant. And there's the sheet set we would open. Already had it open, just wanted to show you how to get there. And we're down in 07. Once again, this is UDS compliant or Uniform Drawing Standard compliant uh, as per the National CAD standard. And we're just going to open this drawing and we're going to open it read only. So the Sheet Set Manager uh, not only allows you to publish sheets, um, but al allows you to see what's there, uh, get to it, print it, um, and you can actually manage a lot of your work uh, through the Sheet Set Manager uh, instead of doing it other ways. So the Sheet Set Manager is a great way to organize your projects. You can literally create sheets up front and then just drop things into them inside the Sheet Set Manager. And we're just going to open that drawing uh, so we can see what's gone. It was produced uh, by the Plan and Profile Wizard, which we're probably not going to get that far along in our pipes project. Um, but that's so that's another um, piece here. But we produced it with the Plan and Profile Wizard. Uh, it's uh, one section of one section of our little roadway down in the start, and so here's where we're going to. And to make it clear what we're talking about, um, I'm just going to plot this single sheet in preview mode and produce effectively a dwarf and give you a look see at what the final results are um, outside of a jump template being applied uh, to typical 09 Civil 3D data. So we end up with um, our roadway showing, uh, new proposed contours, um, solid, all the existing stuff here. And you can see we got some label points uh, in this version of the surface and some of those data points that we were talking about. And they, no matter what color they are, they all show up and print um, uh, scaled back and screened. And here's our plan of profile view. A uh, couple of things about the jump uh, that are set up. All the existing conditions are set up uh, with oblique fonts. You can change that in about five seconds inside the templates. All the proposed stuff uh, set up to be straight up fonts. And we actually employ uh, Windows True Type fonts. Um, instead of SHX fonts, but once again, that's something uh, really easy to customize and do quickly um, inside the jump. 